Hello, hello you guys. And then again. First, I'm not going to speak about my country's situation. I'm not going to speak about any politics. I'm not going to speak about any that kind of government or whatever. I promise there's a blog entry coming, I think, in next Monday. It's a, it's scheduled to next Monday, I think. You will find later the link in the description of the video. So feel free to check it out and see what what has been done with with Venezuela. Anyway, I just wanted to make a video here in the comfortly uh, environment of my room about the first uh, tarot, tarot kind of deck I got. This is not the first deck that I got. The first one was like a, more like Oracle cards. And it was more like a children's toy. This is like the first kind of serious material I got. And you will find it exclusively in Kate Moses' novel, Sepulchre. This is the Spanish edition. And you'll find it. This is this shouldn't be here. You'll find it. You open the book the book. Obviously, this is empty, but you get this half a deck because it's only the major arcana. This is the Ver, the Vernier Tarot. The moon, the justice. Obviously, this is all in Spanish, as you may guess. The devil, the chariot, the star. And as many, well, actually, as all the other tarot decks, it comes with a little book of instructions, instructions for uh, reading with the tarot cards of Suma de Letras, which is the publishing company. As you may see, it's not that extensive, just like four simple cards folded. I mean, there's not a lot of material in here. But this is the first day that I start, that I start with. I'm going to to show you some of the of the cards while I while I speak. So here we go. The first, strange. I think it's in English. This is the first deck that I that I got. This is the one that I learned with. This is the one that I practiced with. This is the magician. If you particularly like like aristocratic and Victorian simple looking decks and not very elaborated images, I think that this might might work perfectly with you. And obviously, if you love the novel, which I would I highly highly recommend you to read, it's kind of slow, soft, slow and heavy at times, but it's worth it. If you are into those kind of decks, and if you love the, the book as I do, too, I would recommend you to try this one out. As I was saying, this is one, the, the one that I got during my senior year. Well, maybe sometime before my senior year. But I practically did like 20, about 20 readings per week during my last year of high school. And it wasn't that easy. It wasn't that easy because, as you know, you just start practicing, you just start learning and stuff. But it's like a very good way to start with, with the rat and to discover if you're really into into this, if you might want to develop more um, interest, more practice, more work, because this is a lot of work. The hangman, what we were talking about, hard work, sacrifice. Because this is something that really demands a lot of time, a lot of support. And well, I just wanted to show you um, a little bit about this. And as I always say, if you have any comment, any opinion, any anything to say about this, if you want me to explain a little more about this topic or whatever you may want, leave it in the comments down below. If you liked it, give it a like, subscribe, share. And well, I guess that I'll see you next time. See you.